looking at Texas A&M, we all knew that that big, huge bite was sitting out there, and we felt like there's no way. But, man, they went ahead and pulled the trigger. They're going to pay him $76 million to, to exit stage left. Who does Texas A&M go after? I mean, you're, you're hearing uh, all types of different names. Uh, Give me know. some. Uh, Dan Lanning at Oregon. I mean, was one of the biggest ones. Did he leave Oregon? He came out yesterday and absolutely said there was zero chance. Why? Of let, Lord, let's stick with yep. him. Let's stick with a few of them. Yep. Let, let's go through a few of these. Yep. Why in the world would you leave Oregon where you've got a chance to play for a national championship, got a really good chance to take an SEC quarterback in Bo Nix and win a Heisman with him at a place where they're a big program. They got a lot of money. They got a lot of donor money. Right. They can play the NIL game maybe as well as anyone out there. Correct. To go to the SEC West and deal with that nightmare, what part of that would you want to bite off that would mean making that decision? I don't. I wouldn't understand that move at all. Yeah, you know, it would have to be an astronomical number that that would be able to entice. And you know, you hear all these absurd numbers that you go, man, there's no way. But I thought we would not see somebody pay $76 million to a guy to walk out the door either. So, really, all that's off the table for me. Are they willing to go out and pay somebody $20 million a year? Could Texas A&M double down? You know, the top coaches in the country right now are making $11, $12 million a year. Are they willing to go pay somebody $20 million a year? Who's worth that? I don't know. But could you entice Dan Lanning from Oregon? You think Dan Lanning's worth that? I'm just saying, if they had – strong on going to get that guy if I'm sticking with Dan Lanning in this situation <laughs> or Kirby Smart or somebody could they entice Kirby Smart away from Georgia for 20 million dollars well, he, he'd be the only one that I think would be worth that kind of money so, Nick Saban would have been worth that kind of money five years ago right